As a caregiver, you may have to help someone shave their face. This can be a bit tricky, and you may be afraid of hurting them, but don't worry, we've got you covered. In this video, we'll give you some tips that will help you learn how to shave the person you're caring for so that with practice, you'll be confident helping out. Let's try it. The first step is to get everything you'll need together. Start with two bowls of warm water with some washcloths and towels. Then you'll need a disposable razor and shaving cream or an electric shaver. We recommend using an electric shaver since it's a lot faster and safer, but we also know some people really prefer to use a disposable razor. If the person you're caring for takes blood thinner medication like aspirin or Coumadin, it's best to only use an electric shaver. It'll also be good to have a mirror on hand and aftershave if they use it. Using disposable gloves is optional, but if you are using a disposable razor, it's best to wear some just in case. If the person you're caring for is able, encourage them to do as much as they can. You can help by handing them supplies or holding up a mirror for them so they can see. If they aren't able to do this themselves, put a towel across their chest and over their shoulders to keep their clothes dry. First, wet a face cloth in the basin of water and start by washing their face. Rinse the cloth after and wring it out again. Then place the warm cloth over their face for a few minutes to help prepare their skin for shaving. This helps soften their beard and helps prevent pulling when you shave. If you're using an electric shaver, you can start shaving now. Hold their skin tight and move the shaver across their face in small circles. If the shaver starts to pull, drag, or not move smoothly, you may need to stop and clean out the shaver. Empty the shaver as often as needed to make sure they have no pain and you get a smooth shave. Follow the manufacturer's instructions on how to empty and clean the model of electric shaver you have. If you're using a disposable razor, put on gloves and start the shave by putting a small amount of shaving cream, about the size of a loony, in your hands. Lather the cream and apply it to any of the areas of their face that'll be shaved. With one hand, hold their skin tight. With your other hand, use the razor to shave in the direction of their hair growth. Use short strokes and rinse the razor in a bowl of water after every pass. Shake off any excess water and continue shaving until their whole face is shaved unless they keep a mustache or beard. Once their face is shaved, Use the second bowl of water to dampen a fresh cloth and wipe their face to remove any pieces of hair or leftover shaving cream. Pat dry with a towel. If you notice any missed spots, that's okay. Just use the razor to go over those spots quickly to finish up. You can finish off by applying aftershave if they like it. Sometimes they might have some bleeding after a shave, which is okay. Put a small piece of tissue over the area and apply direct pressure until the bleeding stops. It usually only takes a few minutes. Finally, hold up the mirror so they can see the great job that you did. Shaving someone can make you nervous. The last thing you want to do is hurt the person you're caring for, but with some practice and these tips as a guide, you'll be able to provide a great shave in no time. Remember, you just want to help them feel a little better. For more videos about personal care and grooming, check out our Care Channel video series.